My name is Katie. Welcome to my Fluid Art channel. If you saw the last video, I did a chaos swipe. It turned out very nice. Uh, drive nice. Today, I want to do an open cup. However, I want to do three at one time. Let me tell you about my colors. I have an iridescent white by Liquitex, 24 karat gold by Deco Art, Extreme Sheen, uh, Cadmium Red Light by Liquitex, uh, Turquoise Blue by Liquitex, uh, Cadmium Yellow Light, or Pale, I'm sorry, by Windsor Newton. Aquamarine Extreme Sheen by Deco Art and Folk Art Color Shift uh, Purple Flash. All right. I want to start with three puddles at once. I've never tried this. So I'm going to pour a puddle right in the middle here and uh, go for it. See where they all fit in there. Ah, they're all experiments. Put a little paint inside. All my paints are mixed one part paint to two parts flow trawl, except for the craft paints, which is the color shift, the deco art. They're mixed one to one. Okay, I'm going to start with a little gold, pour from up high, and I think I'm going to pour them exactly the same. Let's see. Hmm, let's see. No, I think I want to go in with the cadmium red light there's no silicone in any of these paints I'm gonna go I'm gonna go in with the yellow I'm going to put a little white. Now yeah, let's go in with the aqua. Iridescent white. going with the purple flash. Okay, I expected more to come out of these sides. All right. Pretty. Flat, the aqua extreme sheen is beautiful. Let me pour a little more paint around here. Give our puddle somewhere to go. Uh, 
All right. I want to go in with the gold again. Oops. The orange. I'm sorry, cadmium red light. Looks like orange to me. Now some yellow and then the aquamarine. I think that'll be plenty of paint. Put the white in. The paint being forced out when you pour from up high, the paint being forced out of underneath causes cells. Uh, the 24 karat gold extreme sheen is a very reactive paint and so is the um, aquamarine. I wasn't sure what the purple flash would do. This is very pretty. All right, just some aquamarine. Now I think we have plenty of paint. Beautiful. That uh, purple flash with the, what is it, the cadmium red light makes a very pretty color. Now I'm just moving it around a little bit to let everybody know we're painting. Come out. <laughs> All right, I don't have much of this left, but I'm going to pour it around. Do I have some flow extender? I do. And these are table scraps. Let go. It doesn't match our pour, but that's fine. It's going to go over the side. I like my flow extender to be the same consistency as my pour. In hopes that I'll have <laughs> uh, an easier time of tilting. tell you always level your canvas I thought I did these table scraps I'll pick up again and use as a flow extender
I think I'm just going to go around in a circle here. Not sure exactly. direction. And we'll see. I'm not sure about that. paint. You're going to start with the paint in the center of your canvas. I'm going to go to the corner nearest you first. I don't like that one as much. further there. Okay, I'm going to go to that corner near you. that purple. Oh, it's come back to the center. I think I have something in my paint. You want to get whatever you have in your paint out as soon as possible. Love the colors. We have plenty of paint to adjust our composition. So I want to I want to go to the corner nearest you again. I don't know if you can see how sparkly this is. It's beautiful. Okay. Back to the center. I want to go in this direction. You start with your paint in the center and let the weight of the paint push you. I don't know if that's the right term, but let the weight of the paint drive you where you need to go. Incredible. All right, let me turn it around. I'm going to go to that corner.
Rocky, mommy will be out in a little bit. Ooh, loving the colors, loving the colors. Take your time when tilting. You make a lot of, uh, you work hard to mix all your paints. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go off the side nearest you again. And get the paint back in the center. The weight of your paint is where it's moving the fastest. These open cups are a lot of fun. I really enjoy them. They're one of my favorite. Sorry, sorry about that. I like it. I like it a lot. Looks like we got enough paint off. Make sure you get enough paint off your canvas or it may not dry right. Beautiful. When you're done painting, always scrape the bottom edges of your canvas. That paint dripping down will keep pulling paint off of your painting. Touch up your corners. I can see my corner. All right, I'm going to take my gloves off. I'm going to give it a final torch, and then I'm going to bring you down for a closer look. All right. It was quick, but it was a lot of fun. That flash mixed with the um, cadmium red light. <laughs> Sorry about that. I pushed the button on my camera and shut it off. I love the way that purple flash mixed with the, uh, it just looks beautiful with that red, cadmium red light. Sorry about the light. And I like the way the iridescent white hooked up with that aquamarine. Extreme Sheen, it's beautiful. Beautiful. I love the colors. This is going to be even more dramatic when it dries. There's lots of bling. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. It's free. Ring the bell and they'll let you know next time I upload a video. I upload videos every day, almost, just about every day. Thank you. Bye.